she do her Self-made, so gay, do an actor She stop, do, stare, chicks do too Bounce, so bounce, never ever gon' lose Her top-down crew, so smooth, nothing better Boom to the letter, you got to respect her Mama see the off the meter, she a go-getter With the speed of a cheetah, live jabby better So hot, they sweat her like a sweater in a sauna Elegant persona, ready for drama, zeros and commas All up in a bank book, haters give a stank look Even when these cranks push, she push harder No woman, no man does it like she can and get This could happen. I knew this was going to happen. And there's the bell. This match has got the hair on the back of my neck standing up, Michael. This is going to be great. Great one on one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. The largest bullseye is always on someone's back. Yeah, that's bad. I think we've got a moment here, and for Dean Ambrose, what can you tell us? Looking fresh right now, which is good. You gotta wonder how much longer that can last, though. Not a lot of spring left. I'll be shocked if that's not it. Ouch, she's going to be bruised from the head to toe before this one's over. Oh, there's a lot to hit there. Now the question is, is this going to continue? And if so, for how long? If you're looking to make a statement, job well done. Just when you thought a power bomb couldn't get any more devastating, Kevin Owens goes and adds a twist that makes it purely lethal. There's the camel clutch, and somehow he's got to take the pressure off his neck. Just a dominating display. Yeah, I think we could see a lot of punishment inflicted here. There can only be one top dog here in the WWE. Hamill clutch applied, and man, is he pulling back on that neck. He's got him. Are you alluding to earlier, King? Kevin Owens' pop-up powerbomb gives him that little something extra that makes a ton of difference. Yeah, it's like being rammed into the mat from eight feet in the air. How are you supposed to get up from that? Look at Kevin Owens. It's coming. Kevin Owens hit that one. Extra slow getting back to his base here. These are great competitors, great, tremendous gladiators here in WWE. Some of the best superstars that WWE have to offer. Oh my gosh!
We all try to get out. Out of this, out of that, out of a lot of things. But on January 25th, the last place you'll want to be is out. One match, one extraordinary opportunity. One of these men will main event WrestleMania. Who will be the one, one two, three, to stay in? WWE Royal Rumble, Sunday, January 25th, live on WWE Network. Right through that door. And approaching the ring, representing the Wyatt family, weighing 275 pounds, Luke Harper! Wow, this arena has come completely unglued. This one has all the makings of a dream match, Michael. And there's the bell. This one-on-one -on -one battle is underway, and you can cut the tension with a knife. Many pundits still believe there's no better way to settle a score than two people getting in that ring and fighting. Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. Oh, out of nowhere. Looking good now. Well, what's your take right now on Victor? Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. We're going to find out a lot here tonight. Head to head, no excuses. Let's get it on.
I gotta tell you, these guys are in the best shape I've ever seen them in. Two. Up goes Luke Harper for the first time tonight. Victor may be the smaller of the two Ascension members, but his ego is big enough to fill an entire locker room, King. Yeah, this guy thinks he's Smash, Hulk, and the Barbarian all rolled into one. Oh, he missed. Oh, -ho, nobody home that time. Oh, Luke Harper is taking advantage. And there's the reversal from Victor. Oh, no, massive damage done there. Inside the ring again. Yeah, and they should be. This is where the action needs to be. And that one hit with the force of a big rig. Victor's ego is well documented, and unfortunately, it might also be warranted. Like it or not, he's a legit force in the ring. Here's the cover. What's he doing? Stop the count, ref. Is it? Well, you know, for our big guy, Luke Harper can really move. This is what makes him so dangerous. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. God, what a stiff shot. And right on the mark. Quick thinking to avoid that. Uh, Victor is a legit force, Cole. You're right. I'm really impressed with the way he systematically dissects his opponents. He definitely goes in there with a game plan. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. Not today. Too fast. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Man, I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. This could be huge! Of course, this great city of Atlanta was a long time home of WCW prior to the company closing its doors in 2001. You know, when Victor takes to the air for his part in the fall of man, you can take it to the bank that the match is about to be over. He's making a statement here with this attack. Luke Harper shows us some clever offense here. We're seeing two outstanding athletes looking to prove their dominance in there. But only one can walk out victorious. Who will it Harper back suplex face buster? Harper back suplex face buster? Is that what it's called? Looking for the quick pin. I don't think even the referee was ready for that. We've seen some impressive tag team finishers over the years. The Hart Foundation comes to mind. Legion of Doom even powering glory. And to be honest, the Ascension's Fall of Man is right up there among the very best. 